People still confuse content marketing and social media marketing and make the mistake of thinking you can't make money off of free content, but I can share with you my dirtiest little secrets of how we've helped our clients make a thousand dollars a day with free content that's just running around the clock. What is the difference between content marketing and social media marketing? Two incredibly important things for any entrepreneur and any business in 2020. So what I want to share with you in this video is what is content marketing? What is social media marketing? What are the differences between the two and something that you should focus on? in relation to each so that you can start crushing it, make a ton of money with both and start to scale your business and brand in 2020. Hey, so I push and I grind and I push and I grind cause I know one day it's gonna pay y'all. What's up, my name is Mike Sherrod. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. I drop multiple videos every single week helping entrepreneurs scale their business using creative and innovative content and marketing strategies as well as personal branding. So if you do get value from this or if you just wanna support each other because that's what we do as entrepreneurs, all that I ask is a little thumbs up as well as subscribe and tap that notification bell if you haven't already. So let's get straight into the value. So what is the difference between content marketing and social media marketing? A lot of people either think they're the same or a lot of people think they're different but don't understand the differences. So let's get straight to it. Content marketing is primarily focused on engagement. Social media marketing is primarily focused on sales. So let me give you an example starting with content marketing and then we'll get into social media marketing. So content marketing is primarily geared towards generating brand awareness as well as stimulating consumer interest. So this is free content. This is content that you're putting out there on platforms like Instagram, YouTube, LinkedIn, TikTok, Facebook that is free it's free posting and this is stuff that you're not running ads against but it's just out there running engaging your audience constantly staying top of mind and again building relationships that's one of the key components of content marketing is ultimately helping you build deep-rooted relationships with your ideal target audience and avatar so that they can become familiar with you ultimately with social media the goal is to build the like know and trust factor and after you've managed to do that ultimately the goal is loyalty because when you achieve customer loyalty Loyalty, that's when you're going to get increased lifetime value as well as retention. So the goal with content marketing is to be putting out content that's going to engage them, help your audience, provide value to your ideal audience, and constantly stimulate their interest in you and see you as a valuable resource. You want people to come to you for questions related to what you offer, and you want people to see you as a leader. I've got a ton of content on how to build a personal brand and why it's so important to share your story. Check that out in the description where I talk to you in depth about the eight laws of branding that you need to do as a leader and that's ultimately going to shape the type of content that you put out there because you want to be putting out strategic content so many people make the mistake of just putting out content that they want to put out but as a personal brand as an entrepreneur as an influential leader you need to be putting out specific types of content that is going to relate to content marketing that's ultimately again going to attract your ideal target audience and is going to help them see you as a resource they want to look to you as a role model and ultimately what that's going to do is over time increase your sales simply because people work with people and also strong personal brands which are formed by using content marketing get paid more if you look at any of the top entrepreneurs they get paid a lot more than people doing the same thing in the same industry People pay a lot more for Gary Vaynerchuk than the average social media speaker because Gary has put out so much content, he's gone all in on content marketing and in turn, people are paying him more. So the same goes for you. If you wanna to start to get paid more than the average entrepreneur in your space or competitors, if you wanna start attracting people and have people coming directly to you to work with you, ultimately content marketing is going to be an incredible way to do that. Now let's talk about social media marketing. Social media marketing, as alluded to previously, has a focus on sales. So instead of just engagement and brand awareness, building your personal brand, it's more on now business. Content marketing is going to generate you a ton of business over time, but the way you should look at it is that it's not a linear curve. Sales in terms of social media marketing is going to be more linear because it's focused on generating now business, business today, whether it be sales, lead generation, product conversion, anything of the sorts. But with content marketing, you're going to see that it starts off slow and you're not getting as much traction as you hope. And then suddenly it's going to be like a bell curve and it's just going to to take off exponentially. Whereas sales with lead generation or social media marketing, that's going to be more linear depending on your ad budget and your conversion rate. Let me explain an example from my own experience. In 2018, the majority of my business came from social media marketing, paid advertising, paid lead generation. However, in 2019, because I put out so much free content and built my brand, almost all of my business came from people direct messaging me, whether it be DMs on Instagram, 
people sending me messages from comments on YouTube or messages on Facebook. So it switched because of the fact that I built up a personal brand that people like new and trust, saw value in, and ended up becoming loyal to the value I have to provide and the quality that I give. So let me talk about two quick things which are what you should focus on in relation to content marketing and what you should focus on in relation to social media marketing. With content marketing, ultimately your goal is to build trusting, long-lasting relationships. This is going to be a way for you to build deep connections with your clients. And the incredible thing about content marketing is that over time, let's say currently right now you have a couple products or you have a couple services, and in a year from now you want to launch a new product or a new service. If you do content marketing properly, which we help all of our clients do, ultimately when you launch that new business, you're going to have a massive database of people and people that are engaging with your content on a daily or weekly basis that now want to use your new product or service. However, with social media marketing, typically when you launch something new, you have to start new marketing campaigns and you have to start putting out new lead capture campaigns to convert your clients for the new service. So both are incredibly important. Both are absolutely necessary in 2020 and going forward, but you just need to understand how each one works because both have a time and a place, but just make sure that you understand the difference so you can start to maximize your results using each. If you have any other questions about content marketing or social media marketing, drop a comment below if you're interested in having our team help accelerate the path for you, shorten the learning curve and avoid a ton of obstacles. Shoot me a message and I'd be happy to help. Please make sure you give this a thumbs up, subscribe. Thank you so much. Check out this next video because I know you're gonna get a ton of value from it. And otherwise, we'll see you in the next video.